This is what they think about us. This is targeted towards black men. This is how low they think about you. Black women here, all shaking their ass. And you know, let's go to the comments. Let's go to the comments section. Cause I wouldn't be surprised if the comment section is, is just full of just black, gay, LGBT individuals. It all revolves around sex. That's what they think about us. We are nothing but, and then a lot of these black women that are in these um, comments, those are the one. those to me are the most disturbing ones. They think of you as nothing but something to be pumped, dumped, and discarded like yesterday's trash just for a vote. And you wonder why men don't want to marry you? You wonder why men don't want to be with you? You have no respect. And then you got individuals in here saying that uh, Trina is a legend because she has brought in, in all of these individuals that have done nothing but make a mockery of our culture by glorifying sex, glorifying single motherhood. You got a man up here who don't even know who the hell he is. Wearing fake ass nails, wearing fucking eyelashes, and, and apparently he, um, through the grapevine, he also has a BBL. This is this is like some some Sodom and Gomorrah type bullshit. No one respects us on the stage. No one respects us, and y'all wonder why we uh, why so you wonder why we can never get away of, from our stereotypes. This is the reason why. So don't get mad. And honestly, y'all fuck it up for all the black girls who do not want to be wrapped up in all this shit. Because this, this right here is what they think of you. This is what they think of us. It's fucking pathetic. Close your fucking legs. Be a contributor to society other than a sex worker. That's what you was doing on the plantation. Fucking having kids just so the white man can use you any which way he wanted. Y'all just love to be abused. And now you want to rope black men into this shit? Black men who are straight ain't going to fall for this, this, this hoe. And I don't know what the fuck he is, but this, I don't, nah. I don't know what the, who the fuck he is or what the fuck he is. Some confused individual. Nah, you don't represent the black community. You probably represent the ratchet, ghetto side, baby mama having, drug dealing, uh, gang banging side of the black community that most black people don't like. We call those motherfuckers niggas and we don't like them. Y'all do nothing but just uh, spew text, just toxicity into our environment. And you wonder why no one wants to be around us. You wonder why they talk so bad about us. Look how you are displaying. You couldn't have, you, could, you mean you tell me you couldn't find anybody else. I mean, y'all did the same thing with the vaccine. You can't sell anything to the black community without overly sexualizing it, trying to get some coochie. Most of y'all have community dicks anyways. Most of y'all have community pussies anyways. I'm like, this is pathetic. This is what the Democrats, this, you know this is a Democrat talking point, so you know they're trying to um, influence people to go vote Democrat. This is what the Democrat Party thinks of us as black people. Give them some BET, shake a little ass, and say, go ahead and vote. We're going to give you these free things. You know, y'all can sit here and say whatever the fuck you want about the Republican Party. I'll tell you the difference between them and the Democrats. 
I see the Democrats like the snake in the fucking Garden of Eden say, telling you, we'll do all these great things for you. Here, eat this apple. It will, it will replenish you. We'll do all these things for you and all this other stuff. Why wait when I, you can just pull it? You don't have to work for this. Why did God tell you not to do this and all this other stuff? It did nothing but make their lives a living hell after that. That's exactly what the Democrat Party do. They promise you all of these free stuff. They tell you all we're gonna do all these nice things, but you don't understand that that requires them raising taxes, taking your money from you, and then giving it back to you in a form of um, welfare and saying that oh yeah we are see we are helping you. You need us. The difference with the Republicans is look, they're not gonna promise you anything. They will lower taxes to make sure that there's more money flowing around there so you can go out there and get it yourself. But the key difference here is that they expect you to help yourself. Only a slave waits, wait, only a slave waits around for a master to come save them. Nah, I'm not a slave. And these people here, you're fucking disgusting. I don't like it. And it, like, no black man... With common sense, no straight black man who, who has a future, who has children, going to look at this and say, oh my God, yes, I'm going to go vote Democrat just so I can get some community pussy. Like, this is just disgusting. This shit should make every, it should make every person in the black community upset to see that they make a buffoonery out of us thinking they can throw us this and we'll do their bidding and go vote for them. And then you got women in here thinking, well, just the comments in there, oh, people can't take a joke, people can't take a joke, this ain't funny. This ain't a joke. They mean this for real. And the fact you can't even see your ass being played. <laughs> That's just my take on it. We need better, we need better black entertainment. This shit is just fucking filthy. Let's go back to the days where black entertainment wasn't filled with this sex, nasty ass garbage. I'll let you guys go. Have a good day.